Pell poll as well, guys, and the Mets sign uh, Jed Lowry, two-year, $20 million deal. You know, uh, Lowry played um, with the Oakland Athletics, you know, set career highs with 23 home runs and 99 RBI last season as a member of the Athletics. Listen, he had a really good season in uh, in Oakland's ballpark there, which is pretty huge. You know, switch hitter, takes his walks, nice OBP, doesn't uh, strike out too much. It's a good signing. He carries himself like a true professional and very solid player. Um, you know, um, what can you say? Uh, the thing I kind of think about... It, um, you know, it's it's a depth move too. It's kind of uh, a team that can sustain multiple injuries. He's a true number two hitter and could even lead off with his OBP. Uh, nice infield, upgraded uh, bullpen. You know, catcher. You know, um, I think the lineup needs kind of one more uh, piece and bullpen. The lack of catching depth and rotation depth kind of needs to be looked at too. Much better team. Still, it's just going to be hard to beat um, uh, to beat that Braves lineup. When you look at this uh, signing there, um, you know, and maybe I'm just thinking out loud here. Unless they can trade Frazier, I don't know where he's going to play in Lowry. I would have realistically maybe even liked them to use that money for another bullpen arm instead, and maybe you know Frazier will sit against tough righties. Uh, not really sure though. Not really sure what, how, um, you know, the game plan is, especially with how they talked about McNeil and when they bring uh, Alonzo up. Um, maybe can't they do both? You might ask. I mean, it's, you know, for once you have an, you have more players than positions. You take that, I guess, rather than the other way around. Accumulate talent and hope. The manager uses it the right way. Um, you know, and the ownership is the way it is, right? If they have one more 10 to $12 million contract to give, you know, who are you going to give it to? Um, you know, um, Stary stocked in the infield, that's for sure. Traded prospects for J.D. Davis a couple of days prior. Uh, you know, they still need a bullpen, I think, and uh, rotation debt. Not to mention, you now Broxton, who knows if he's even a uh, major league uh, caliber fourth outfielder. Uh, but, you know, again, Larry, solid player on and off the diamond. Uh, what this guy is doing uh, in, in, in Brody, uh, Brody there, the GM, I think he's. The common theme is he's signing now. I know you guys want Harper and Machado, but what he is doing is he's signing team players. He's trying to change the culture in the locker room with better leaders. Team players. Team players. So, uh, you know, I, I, I like what Larry did. You know, he's, he, he's 34, but he's not over the hill. So, Probably could get, you know, uh, those two years probably be quality years that you signed him for. At least you would hope. Hope all is well. Look forward to speaking to you guys very, very soon.